Hello everyone, you are welcome to how to solve this very nice 6 degree equation x to the power 6 plus 2x to the power 5 plus 2x to the power 4 minus 2x squared minus 2x minus 1 is equal to 0. Our job is to find all possible values of x. So let's start. We notice that in this expression we are missing the term with x cubed and here we have a constant 1. So we add here x cubed and we subtract x cubed. So this equation will become x to the power 6 plus 2x to the power 5 plus 2x to the power 4 plus x cubed minus x cubed minus 2x squared minus 2 times x minus 1 is equal to 0. Now from these four terms we can factor out x cubed. So x cubed as common factor in back left x cubed plus 2 times x squared plus 2 times x plus 1. And from these four terms uh, we can factor out negative 1. Negative 1 as common factor in back left uh, x cubed plus uh, 2x squared plus uh, 2 times x plus uh, 1 is equal to 0. And as you can see this expression is a common factor. So we factor out this expression x cubed plus uh, 2 x squared plus uh, 2 times x plus 1 as common factor and in back left in back left this x cubed and this negative 1 in back left x cubed minus 1 is equal to 0 and from here is this expression x cubed plus 2x squared plus 2 times x plus 1 is equal to 0 or this expression x cubed minus 1 is equal to 0. Now first we solve this cubic equation. Factors of this one are plus minus 1 and if we put x is equal to negative 1 in this equation this will become negative 1 cubed plus uh, 2 times uh, negative 1 squared plus uh, 2 times uh, negative 1 plus 1 is equal to 0. Negative 1 cubed is negative 1 plus uh, negative 1 squared is 1 and 1 times 2, 2 and 2 times negative 1 negative 2 plus 1 is equal to 0. And this is equal to 0, it means that uh, x is equal to negative 1 is a uh, root. So, x plus 1 is a uh, factor. So, we rewrite this equation as uh, x cubed plus uh, we write this uh, 2x squared as uh, x squared plus uh, x squared. And we write this uh, 2x as uh, x plus x plus this 1 is equal to 0. From these two terms uh, we can factor out x squared in back left uh, x plus 1. And from these two terms uh, we can factor out uh, plus x in back left uh, x plus 1. And from these two terms, uh, we can factor out plus 1 in back left uh, x plus uh, 1 is equal to 0. And this x plus 1 is a common factor, so we factor out this uh, x plus uh, 1. And uh, in back left, uh, in back left this x squared, this plus x and this 1. In back left uh, x squared plus uh, x plus 1 is equal to 0. 
Now from here either this expression x plus 1 is equal to 0 or this expression x squared plus uh, x plus 1 is equal to 0. From this equation we get the value of x is equal to negative 1 and from this quadratic equation x is equal to negative value of b is 1 plus minus square root of in place of b squared we write 1 squared minus 4 times a is 1 times c is 1 divided by 2 times a is 1 and x is equal to negative 1 plus minus square root of this 1 squared is 1 minus 4 times 1 times 1 is 4 divided by 2 and x is equal to negative 1 plus minus square root of 1 minus 4 will become negative 3 divided by 2. Next x is equal to negative 1 plus minus this square root of negative 3 can be written as square root of negative 1 times square root of 3 divided by 2 and uh, x is equal to negative 1 plus minus this the square root of negative 1 will become i times root 3 divided by 2. This is the second and third value of x and first we found the value of x value of x is equal to negative 1. This is the first value of x. Now, we solve this case uh, x cube minus 1 is equal to 0. This one is same as uh, 1 cubed. So, according to this uh, algebraic identity a cubed minus b cubed is equal to a minus b times uh, a squared plus uh, a b plus b squared. This will become x minus 1 times x squared plus x plus 1 is equal to 0. From here either this expression x minus 1 is equal to 0 or this expression x squared plus x plus 1 is equal to 0. From this equation we get the value of x is equal to 1 and uh, from this equation we get the same solutions uh, x uh, 5 and 6 is equal to negative 1 plus minus i times root 3 over 2 and value of uh, x 4 is equal to value of x 4 is equal to 1 x4 is equal to 1. So, we have 6 solutions x1 is equal to negative 1, x second and third is equal to negative 1 plus minus i times root 3 over 2 and x4 is equal to 1. The fifth and sixth value of x is equal to negative 1 plus minus i times root 3 over 2.